Assalamualaikum, hi everybody. Oh, yeah, really bad lighting. Assalamualaikum, hi everybody. Um, I just wanted to give you a brief update on my day number five, which was Tuesday the 26th. Anyhow, for breakfast I had a half of an apple with a cream cheese bagel. Now I know you're probably thinking, oh, cream cheese bagel, ew, bad, yuck, not good for you. That's true, it's not. Um, it had raisins in it <laughs> and cinnamon and swir cinnam swirls. Um, but anyhow, I originally got it for my husband. I thought he would like the treat in the morning, but unfortunately he didn't, <clears throat> fortunately for me. So um, every once in a while I'll have that and try to you know eat less calories throughout the day. So um, uh, yesterday morning I had that with coffee, of course. <laughs> And um, for lunch, or for the snack, I had this. Okay, so this is um, like uh, chips, except they're raw sweet potato chips. I just peel them and then cut them into slices like these. Mm. And eat them. Oh, don't throw them in there. <laughs> it's funny. But um, yeah, eat this for lunch and kind of have it as a snack and munch on it. And I'll put in the calories, inshallah, so you know how much. It's one sweet potato, I think like two cups of them. Yeah, at least two cups here. I just posted the video. Yum, yum, yummy. I'm all motivated. <laughs> and um, it's really good raw. You know, when you cook food, like uh, Islam in the Home was talking about, it loses the nutrients in the food. Also, um, you know, when you cook the, the chips, you have to um, put a little bit of oil on it. That's extra calories that you don't necessarily need. So um, I like the raw ideas are really good, definitely. Um, anyhow, and then for dinner, here's my recipe for, um, <clears throat> one of the recipes I have for making shrimp. I don't know, honey. All right, so try warm the pan first. So it's nice and hot. Now what we're going to do is dry. Um, now I don't want to use oil. I'm going to try this as, um, make this as uh, calorie free as possible. So it's one onion. And stick it in there. Now I've got one can of this petite diced tomatoes because tomatoes are really expensive, fresh. I like two something a pound. I'm gonna put the whole thing in there because this is gonna be on spaghetti for my husband. I'm gonna stick some of these in there so they can get nice and cooked through. And then we're gonna add the spices. Garlic and rosemary, of course. Blend it up, flush it up, and add the fresh garlic. About uh, one tablespoon of fresh garlic. Okay, so I just added the uh, spices. I'm gonna stir that into it also. And let this cook for a little bit. Okay, I added the mushrooms and the shrimp. Mix it up a little bit. It's hard to manage the one hand. Yeah, okay, I need to turn this off. <laughs> okay, so I just mix that all together, close the lid, and I will see how long it takes this time. It's on high. Let me turn it down a little bit so it doesn't like burn all the water out or the juices out. Okay, so it's 7.05 ish. I think that's the right time. Wow, is that already seven? Anyhow, so that's gonna be cooking. I'm gonna make some noodles for my husband and son. Okay, so it is boiling. Yum, yum, yummy. And it's 7.17. It definitely has a little bit more to go. Um, I bought the shrimp that's already cooked with the tail off and everything, but I'm just cooking it to like soaks up some of the spices. Okay, all done. It's 7.23.
Looks yummy. I'm Jilla. So I hope you all enjoyed it. Um, my total calories for the day is probably there. I um, hope you your all diets are going well, uh, God, inshallah, God willing. And um, yeah, stick with it, guys. You know, the key to everything in life is, well, not the key to everything, as if I have the secret to life, but one of the keys to life is definitely patience. Patience and perseverance, you know, sabr. So it's, you know, um, even the Quran or, you know, the Quran says that the successful one is the one that's patient. It's true whether in your religion or whether in your uh, diet or whether in your career or whether in your motherhood or your, you know, relationships with your husbands, your relationships with your parents, with your friends. You know, in anything that you really want to do, whether it be a hobby, the key is really the patience and perseverance. So I truly believe that, and I think that's one of the wisdoms of the Quran, one of millions. So, assalamu alaikum, peace be on all of you. I hope your diets are going very well. Bye, guys. See you tomorrow, hopefully, inshallah. If not, I'll post a video of um, what I ate today, inshallah. Bye. I have whispered to you as I made ruku Subhana Rabbi ala deen But was my faith bright or grey? Oh Allah, tell me what did I do today? Did I smile at my brother? Was I kind to my mother? Did I teach another something that I know? Or did my love of this world lead me astray? Tell me what did I do today? Zami Allah, man hamida Rabbana laika alhamd Sami Allahu liman hamida Rabbana